Jonathan Trott will remember this game for the rest of his life. Not because he'd just taken two wickets before lunch, not because he'd previously scored 166, but because he'd made cricket history by taking this amazing catch in his trouser pocket. Absolutely amazed. Never seen it happen before, never see it again. <laughs> the Edgbaston members were almost lost for words, and in the BBC commentary box, they couldn't quite believe it either. Absolutely extraordinary. I mean, it does happen occasionally that the ball can get stuck in a, a fielder's clothing, but to actually go straight into the pocket was, uh, was pretty remarkable. Let's take another look at that. Trot fielding at short leg. The ball gets caught in his pocket, and that's out. There are some things they don't teach you at umpire college, but the men in white were spot on. Outside the pavilion, the members were in no doubt. Armed with the MCC rule book, they pointed me towards Law 32, Section 3B. A catch shall be considered to have been fairly made if the ball is hugged to the body of the catcher or accidentally lodges in his clothing. I jumped for my life, really, and suddenly turned around. I sort of actually looked for the ball, and then I felt something sort of lodged in my pocket. I thought it was the... Uh, the hand warmers that we actually had was it was a bit chilly yesterday and just pulled the ball out. It was there and quite bizarre. I've got the bruise to uh, prove, so uh, it, was, it was quite funny. What was the reaction from the lads afterwards? Yeah, it was quite funny. The guys sort of uh, all had a laugh and hope to catch the next ones with my hands, to be honest. In all my experience, never seen anything like it in my life. So uh, very fortunate, firstly, not to get a bigger bruise and secondly, for it to end up in his pocket and get a wicket. I know what you're thinking, how difficult is it to catch a cricket ball in your trouser pocket? Well, it's not easy, but anything's possible with a bit of practice. Just don't ask me to stand at short leg, only a few feet away from a hard-hitting batsman. I'll leave that to Jonathan Trott, the trouser pocket king of Warwickshire cricket.